Oh hey, didn't see you there inside my granddad's living room. Hi, my name's Matt, I'm a travel vlogger, content creator, and I'm from the UK, and I post weekly videos to this YouTube channel. This week, I'm going to Prague, and I am super excited. I'm gonna be shooting some awesome travel guides, some travel vlogs, with loads of the best tips, and all the best things to do when you're in Prague. So make sure you smash the subscribe button, also smash the like button, because that's fun. But in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys my top travel essentials for a short city break, using only my carry-on luggage. Now, this is gonna help you to avoid those unnecessary charges from those budget airlines because that's where they sting you. This is exactly what happened to me last year. I paid 18 quid for my return flight to Barcelona, but then when I wanted to add luggage, the price more than doubled. And just out of principle, I was like, I'm not paying more for the luggage than the actual fare itself. I decided to pack everything in my carry-on luggage. I'm gonna show you guys how you can do exactly the same thing. Now, all of the items that I'm gonna be talking about in today's video will be linked in the description below to Amazon, which is the cheapest place online that you'll ever be able to find them. And every single time you guys make a purchase using those links below, it goes to support this channel. So please, if you need anything, use those links below. Buy everything. Go through individually on each of those links and buy every single thing and help make me rich. I'm just joking, I get like 2p per purchase. You know what? It all adds up. Every little helps. Now the first most important thing on your travel essentials is obviously going to be a suitable rucksack, a suitable case. Budget airlines, they'll often have dimensions for the bags that you're allowed to bring on as a free small carry-on. But those dimensions are primarily for hard suitcases because they'll have those metal barricades and as long as your suitcase can fit in there or your rucksack, you're absolutely fine. Now I'm going to be in Prague from Tuesday through Friday, so four days. So I'm gonna pack five pairs of underwear and five pairs of socks. And in terms of clothing, I'm gonna bring four t-shirts, one for every day, and then maybe an extra two, which will act as like evening wear. Next up, you're gonna need a suitable pair of shorts, especially if it's the summer in Europe, because it's gonna be super hot. But these shorts are absolutely amazing. They actually mean I don't need to bring a rucksack with me because I can fit so much stuff in those short pockets. Next up, with the toiletry bag, I'll pack one of these flimsy ones. You can basically get more space because you can scrumple it up. And with that, I'll bring a toothbrush, toothpaste, antiperspirant, hair wax. In terms of skincare, I'll pack all of that stuff in little small containers. Who really wants to be carrying, you know, the whole thing? Next, of course, is all of my electronics. Laptop, chargers, travel adapters, external hard drive, which is essential for me. Super, super important. It's amazing. It's a three terabyte one. You can basically drop it and it will never get damaged. Sound cancelling Sony headphones. And this is the best thing on earth. It's my Anchor power bank charging hub. Charges your iPhone. I think an iPhone 11 like six, seven times over. Passport, wallet with some euros. You should always bring some cash with you. But I do have a credit card as well, which allows me to pay for things in different currencies and it doesn't charge me anything more than the actual exchange rate. Now next we've got my camera equipment, DJI Mavic Mini, which is actually my dad's. And of course my camera setup. Okay, so cannot believe I nearly forgot to tell you guys about this. This is possibly the best water bottle on earth. This is my mini one that's going to be suitable for this trip. Called a Bobble water bottle. And this isn't sponsored, but Bobble, if you want to, obviously hit me up. Most cities in Europe have clean drinking water, which is great, but you can just basically be extra sure that you're going to be drinking super clean filtered water. Now, in addition to all of that stuff, I'll also bring a small bag just to carry it around with me. So this is ideal to just put around my shoulder, you know, it looks all right. It just means you've got an extra space to maybe put your wallet in. So this is pretty much everything that I'm gonna be taking with me for my four day trip. Now you guys are probably wondering how on earth are you gonna get all of this stuff in this rucksack? Well, guess what? I'm about to show you. So in this laptop compartment, obviously the laptop goes. Next, we're gonna stick the drone in this pocket all the way to the bottom, underwear, and put the socks in the corners. T-shirts, fold them once, fold them twice, and then obviously put that, put them nicely in there, nice and folded, as you can see. Now you see why I use a, a drawstring, drawstring bag over one of those hard ones. Stick my headphones on top of there. Spare bag, shorts. Next, I'll put all my remaining electricals, like my chargers, my camera, accessories, wires, in this little compartment here. 
just like that. Might also stick the lens in there as well. Passport, I'll generally stick in the front pocket because it's easy to access. Stick my wallet in my jeans that I wear to the airport along with my AirPods. Sunglasses in the front sunglasses part. And then just stick it in there, as you can see. Voila. So yeah, you guys might be thinking, well, what about your footwear? Well, of course. My trainers, comfy pair of trainers, I'll just wear them to the airport on my feet. Stick your jacket on as well, light jumper. Look at that, I'm all set, all ready to go. Four days in Prague. And hopefully that is gonna help you avoid any of those unnecessary charges because nobody wants an unnecessary charge, do they? Do you want an unnecessary charge? If you don't want an unnecessary charge, smash the like button below. So there you go, everything has fit in my carry-on rucksack. Drinks bottle in that side, my gorilla pod in that side, which is my tripod. And then I'll just simply carry my camera around my neck in my hand like that. So when I walk up to the gate, obviously I've only got a rucksack on, which is my small bag. And I'll just carry my camera in my hand. And that is how I get around any unnecessary luggage charges. Shout out to Ryanair and EasyJet and all the others. And that is it for this week's video. I do hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have, smash that thumbs up button down below. Also hit the red subscribe button and turn it red, turn it gray actually. Also hit that bell button so you get notified every single time I post a weekly video. As always, I shall see you guys next week in Prague.